Hey, 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 Captain Chris Johnson here. What's happening to my three people? <laughs> That's still funny to me. Uh, Red is going on at one o'clock today, uh, probably because he's mooring his boat. And Marty will be going on at 12, so I got to get this going. What's happening today? My goodness, what is today? Today is Thursday. What goes on Thursday? I don't know anything that goes on Thursday, to be honest with you. Me, Marty, Red, we happen on Thursdays. That's what's going on. Uh, I think there's a, hold on, let me double check. I think there's a, uh, Lynn, let me double check because I don't want to mess that up. Lynn and, uh, I'll tell you in a second here, as soon as I get my bearings in order. Uh, webinars. I think Lynn's got one today with uh, with comfort, and I'm not sure if it's at two o'clock, four o'clock. I'm not sure. I know Def Slam will be going on today. Uh, check that out. That's later. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, for all my hard of hearing folks, absolutely love what you're doing. You guys got to always remind me because at that time I'm always doing something. So, but make sure you remind me. Uh, listen, I'm still fired up about what happened the last couple days. Excuse me, with 360 with the Ash birthday meeting. Um, I have a lot of people that still asking me questions about it. So what I've been telling people to do is go to 360. Uh, that's why we did that. That's why Ash wanted to do it. And let's get this broke down because he explained exactly what, what it is. Let me clarify something. Uh, what do I always say? It's all done for you. Ash even showed <laughs> if you did nothing, what, what would happen? Okay, so don't get confused. I think a lot of people are thinking, oh my God, I got to sell. No, what he did is he broke down. If you did go out there and get someone 100%, that's what he was trying to say, but do not get scared. It's the same as it always has been. You sign up, you stay plugged in, which is going into your back office. Check out a webby once in a while. And uh, as Ash said, be patient. Let me do all the work. And that's for a lot of people who are asking me. Now, I'm going to also talk about pendings. He said the 20th is the last day of pendings. I got a lot of questions about pendings. Uh, I don't know why. Hold on. I don't know why these guys do this. Uh, I, I'm on. Marty. I'm on my live right now. I'll get back with you guys. Jeez, oh, pizzas. Tell the couple people in here. <laughs> I got a lot of people on here. Bye. Oh, just say hi. <laughs> you guys, you guys are so, you guys are so, so considerate of my time. You know that? Unbelievable. All right, bye. I'm going to go talk about something important right now. Bye. <laughs> Oh, look at that. My whole core team decides to call again when I'm on my live. Aren't they, don't they just really nice to me? Isn't it unbelievable? So let me tell you about pennings. This morning I woke up because I posted pennings are going to be done on the 20th. I have lots of them, guys. I mean, I mean, I have lots of them. And guys, can I have multiple? You can have whatever you want. You don't have to ask me. You just send me the information, which is first and last name. A, a, new, a new email that has not been used in a past and a phone number. That's simple. I'll get it done. I got quick fingers. I got some last night early in the morning when I woke up, boom, bang, boom. First thing I do. So, yes, to answer all your questions, I got pendings. Now, I do say check your own back office. <clears throat> Excuse me. Go under your team, click on team, and then it'll say all these options. Click on pendings. See if you have any. If you have a pending, buy those for yourself. A lot of people don't even realize that. Yeah, I have pending because I advertise the crazy stuff out of it. But listen to me. You could have pendings. Check your back office. Like I said, go to team. Click on team. Uh, they are starting to get taken. As far as I know, I had a couple people say Chris mine are gone. Ash Bafar is probably getting in the system start taking these pennings. So get them out there while you can. Very, very important. Uh, so... He had talked about this, uh, which everyone is, this is where I was the shock, the shell shock. 
I don't really think people really realize how big this. Uh, okay, I'm going to say soccer, but it's football in the, in the other lang in the other countries. That's how they say it. We say football in America, which is hey, four downs and boom. Soccer and football is two different things, but it's huge. Um, I never really realized how big soccer was until I started going out of the country. And I'd be going out, sitting on the beach, and I'd see everyone run into like the bar where the TV is. I'm like, wow, what's going on? Something must have happened. Uh oh, I'm in another country. Uh oh, I'm scared. I go there, and everyone's watching the soccer game. Listen, in other countries besides America, and America's getting there. Football or soccer is humongous. This is a. This is drop the kids off. We're going to the soccer game, <laughs> or take the kids to the soccer. Game. It's that important. These guys, it's it's a religion to them, especially if their countries are in playing, but they still enjoy it. Uh, I firsthand got to see it in South America, Colombia. Uh, when I went on a cruise, there was a couple games going, and everyone forgot about the cruise. We all went watch the hockey game. Pr pretty amazing. I mean, young, old, they were all there. That's how that's how big this is. <laughs> God, I'm ignoring them. That's how big this is. When they said that we were joining up with the FIFA and the World Cup as a sponsor, you guys, I've been waiting for that for the last couple of weeks because it kind of slipped out. I don't think he really wanted to say it back then, but they did. But it did prepare you, but I still can't be prepared. You have no idea really how big this is. When someone, someone texts me and says, why? Why would we sponsor in the FIFA if we're not even watched? You know, you don't get it. Ash has got a plan. Ash has got a plan. Here, let me say it again. He's got a plan. He knows exactly what he's doing. You imagine there's going to be, let's see, it was two two billion people the last time. Now it's expected to be five billion people that watch this World Cup. All right. A pass is going to be here, there, up there, down. It's going to be everywhere. Do you know how many people are going to be Googling and passive? All right. Do you know how many people, right? Five billion are going to be seeing this. And guess what happens when they Google and pass it? What are they going to see? Think about it. They're going to see me, Red, Marty, because we're always talking about it. Pat, Parrot, Sherry Dearsway, Julie Wynn, Peter Scherz, because we're out there talking about it. That's what we've been trying to tell you guys. Five billion people, folks, are going to be saying, what the heck is a passive? They're going to be clicking on it. We're going to be showing up. They got to come through us to get into a passive. Do you guys still forget that? Or do I have to keep reminding you every day? Excitement, excitement. We shook up the world. I told you this. This is what's so exciting about this. Let's not count the 8 billion people that are in this world. 5 billion people are going to be watching a bunch of guys kick a ball around into a net. And in that beautiful, wonderful game, exciting game, all around it, you're going to see a passive going around the loop. Could be on jerseys. It's going to be up on the big camera. It's going to be everywhere. Do you get it? Do you get it? And you guys got the, the people texting me saying, hey, Chris, do we have to do something? Heck no, you don't. Ash Mafara, he just, woo, he just pulled the anchor right out of the ocean with his bare hands and we're sailing, folks. Are you with me? Are you with me? Do you get it now? Do you get it now, guys? This is one huge event. It's the biggest event. Imagine in the futures that a pass is going to be on all the events. And you're just that little old founder who one day said, ah, I'll give it a try. I guess I'll go throw over $97 and check it out. Now you're sitting in a multi-trillion dollar company advertising everywhere. The biggest sports, the biggest news. Bada bing, bada boom. We shook up the world. Do you get it yet? Are you fired up? Because I came out here to fire you up. To all you people that said, even you founders, well, I don't know if this is going to really happen. He just showed you that it's happened and it's been happening. But you got to have the faith. You got to have faith, guys. He said, be patient. Look at my patience got me. Woo! -hoo! FIFA World Cup 2022. Red, by the way, not 2020. <laughs> He's, that's because that boat, when you're on a boat, your brain kind of switches back and forth and he forgets a lot. So, But do you guys understand how important this is?
You get it? I want you to start talking about on passive. Five billion people are going to be Googling and say, what the heck is on passive? I want the Sebastiana, the Frida, Lystra T. I want them to see you. They're going to be coming to you. Hey, man, can you tell me a little about a passive? How do I get in? Woo! Collecting information for when we launch to the world. Oh, my goodness. Wow, bang, bang, boom, bop, up the room, back and forth. Look out. It's coming. I've been telling you. Do you get it now? Are you fired up? Do you understand that you are part of something that is so big that my dreams are all going to come true? Your dreams are going to come true. Start thinking about things that you've always thought about. Because you said back then, eh, it'll never happen. I don't got nothing. You know, I make this much money. And guess what? Ash Mafardi broke that. Do you understand? He broke that. He broke the mold to the normal. It's now unique. It's now bing, bang, boom. You are a founder. Dream bigger, he keeps telling us. You're not dream dreaming big enough, folks. Dream bigger. All those things that you loved in life that maybe you thought other people were enjoying and you watched it on the computer or the TV. That's going to be you. That's going to be you water skiing in the ocean. That's going to be you sitting on that white beach way out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, your own island? That's going to be you. Dream bigger, the man says. <clears throat> Do you guys understand how much he's actually done? Some of you, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm still sick, but I'm still going to go at it. Do you understand what this man has done for all of us? Give me an amen. Give me some amens. How many of you really understood what Ashma Farah has done for all of us? Give me an amen. Let me see it. Come on. I want to see some amens on there. All right. Guys, that's us. That's us. As far as I'm concerned, he's answered all my prayers. The dreams that I've always had that I wanted to do that I thought I never could, I'm going to be able to do it. The help around the world for every person Every person is going to be unbelievable. Oh, bless. Oh, bless. Oh, bless. Oh, yes. We're cleaning up the mess. You are going to become successful. You are going to become wealthy. You are going to get out there and help everyone that you can. That's a gimme. That's a gimme. Because that stuff that's coming your way, it's going to keep coming. You ain't going to dig a hole and put it in your backyard. You're going to go, you're going to go create things for people to help them out, pay their mortgages. Get him involved in and passive. The world is going to know and passive, and you're part of it. Do you understand that? You are part of it. I don't want you guys ever to forget that. You are part of something that's bigger than we could ever imagine. You know, we watched this, the Google, how they started. Amazon, how they started. They got pictures of a few people way back then. We got pictures of a million, over a million people. Remember, 50 years from now, I'll be driving that big old sports car. This young kid's going to walk up and say, hey, what do you do for a living? I'm going to pass a founder. I took it. I seen it. I ran with it. I joined it. You look at me now, baby. And that'll probably be your great grandkids because you can leave all this to them. I know I'm not going to live forever. Hell, especially the way I've been going. But I know my kids are going to enjoy it. I know my grandkids are going to enjoy it. it. Wasn't about me. It was about setting something up. When I die, my my Ford pension gone, gone. I've said this other times, but now I'm living through a passive. And even when I die, which I'm going to someday, my kids are going to be living with it. My grandkids, their grandkids. It's going to keep going on and on and on. And maybe 500 years down the road. Someone's going to say, man, you know that my great, 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 great grandfather decided to join this company. And look what we have now. He say, thanks, grandpa. And I'll be saying, don't thank me. Thank that guy we call Ash Mafara. Really, really cool stuff, guys. I want to fire you up today. It's Thursday. The launch is coming. It's Thursday. And the launch is coming. Don't you forget that. Go go do your job right now. Go fishing. Go clean the house. Go get your hair cut. Go get your nails done. 
Go get your toes curled. I don't care. Let this happen because it's already happening. World Cup, baby. Go! If you don't know what that is, you're going to. Go check out a soccer game or a football. I don't want them to get mad at me. You guys get it? Fire up. Fire up. Hey, you know who's got a birthday today? Actually, two of my brothers got birthdays today. John Barilla, our commissioner. Happy birthday, John. I think he's, what, 32? <laughs> and Ravi. I want to say this right. Ravi Shaker Singe. Happy birthday to you, my brothers. You guys are in the best place you're going to be for a birthday. Let me tell you that. Let me tell you that. Guys, and if there's something else going, because my brain is strictly concentrating on excitement today, pop it in here. Pop it in here. I know there's webinars going. Let's keep people fired up, excited. Plug in. This is crazy. You get it? You can't even say that good anymore. This is crazy. And this isn't crazy. You guys ever see that? They do like a TikTok or YouTube, and you hear it's from a movie, the race car dude and his chick. I can't remember. She says, what is this place? This is heaven. Welcome, folks. That's what your life's going to be like. Every morning you wake up, every time you go to sleep. What is this place? Why? Because a passive is going to be helping you with everything. With everything. You haven't heard it all. You haven't heard it all, but when you do, <laughs> but when you do, it's already going to be happening. I don't even know that you're going to want to care what's happening. You're just going to be happy that's happening. Woo, let me look. Wallet. Holy cow. Honey, pack your bags. We're going to Uai. Hey, honey, pack your bags. We're going to go watch a soccer game. Do you get it? Can you dig it? <laughs> All right, let me say hi to a few people, and then I'm getting on here. Patty McGuigan, what's happening? I see you. The very first person today was Mary, a new one. She beat out M. Kelly. Uh-oh, where's M. Kelly? Frida, what's happening? Tanya Hunter, what's going down? Yavanya Finn. Yavanya? It's Yavan Finn. <laughs> Ruth Base, how you doing? Oh, someone's saying hi to Ash. Ash is on here? Uh, I don't know he's on here. I don't know what. Listen, he said something yesterday. If you were listening, he's going to start with me. I don't know when that's going to start, but he might be on. Oh, he is. We shook the world. That's right, Ash Bafara. He's on here. Remember, Ash said some, something. I don't know when that's going to start. And uh, <laughs> it is. If you go back. Now, listen, Mr. Marty and Mr. Ash. Go back and find the original video. He did. We shook up the world is what he said. And he said, I'm so pretty. He didn't mess up my face. I'm so pretty. And that was one of my my, my favorite boxer of all world, uh, Muhammad Ali. And he definitely shook up the world. But you know what? He shook up the world for himself because he beat a great fighter, Sonny Liston. Ash Mafar is shaking up the world for all of us. Where you could run around and say, I did shake up the world. I was part of shaking up the world. I think it's pretty cool. Ash, thanks for coming on here. What a, what a surprise. Rippin, what's happening? Uh, Steiner, what's how you doing? Lister T, where's your sister? Danielle, what's happening? Daniela, uh, Majori, Rupa Paul, what my beautiful sister from India, how you doing? Kathy Sampson, woohoo! John Yannard, Michigander, uh, Julie Wen, there you are. What's up, Julie? I know you got a lot of driving to do today. Also, saying some prayers for Julie's, uh, Julie's ex-husband or the father of her kids was put in the hospital. He might have to have surgery. Please say some prayers for him. Um, and also, Julie is traveling today to take her daughter back to college. Please say some um, prayers for her, her safe travels for her and her kids to get her to college. Norell work on. Bing, bang, boom. Norell is in the room. What's happening in Australia? New Zealand. Ken Patterson. I know he'll be on here. Yvonne Nackett, my Australia and New Zealand brothers and sisters. Mm, let me jump. Let me jump. Rita, what's happening? After hours with my girlfriend, Willow. Hey, Willow. What's happening? Keep that smile, girl. Uh, Rita, what's happening? Casey Zevenberg. You know what I'm looking for, Casey? There's another guy in here. His name is Kim. <laughs> and once again, 
We've been calling him a girl <laughs> because of his name. He's actually a guy. He just had a grandchild, I think. Congratulations. Also, David Switzer. David Switzer just had a, a, a grandchild. Congratulations to you both, Papas. Way to go. See, I pay attention, guys. You don't know it, but I do pay attention to try to get you all. Uh, Juana, what's happening? New York's in the house. Dana's energy. Hope I answered that question for you. Oh, I didn't. There was a Singapore this morning. I'm not sure where that's at. Uh, I, you could ask Tina Go. She probably know her or Dr. Bill. Uh, Majori, how you doing? Steve Newell. Harvey Green. What time is it? I got to make sure I get Marty on here in time. Oh, I got nine minutes. Uh, sec, that's it. Marty is going to be on at, at noon, which is about nine minutes. But you know Marty's time. Marty says noon. He usually comes on 12.03, 12.05. That's how he does it. And it, it's not. It's because they're on the phone right now. They're on the phone right now. Completely forgetting about me, but that's okay. The most important guy is on here is Ash Mafara. <laughs> and they're all going to be jealous. Too bad for them. Uh, <laughs> Johnny... Living, how you doing? Elvis, what's happening? Gotta love that name. Elvis has not left the building. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, hey, Sabias, I had Gene Levia text me say I'm saying your name wrong. Now, I thought I was saying it right. It's Sabias or Sabas? I think it's Sabias. You're going to have to text me. Say who's right. Is Gene right or am I right? No, because she's a lady now. Tell the truth. Sabias Jana or Sabas Jana? Just say Chris, yes. Or genius. That's all you got to do. And I'll find it in the comments. Uh, Prasad, how you doing? We are in it to win it. Diona, Roy, McPhail, what's happening? Uh, Rippin, Patrick McGuigan, there you are. I'm glad you're coming to the great side, Patty. I won't tell Red. <laughs> Gemma, there's Gemma, what's happening? Uh, look at all those amens. I'm fire. You dang right, I'm fired up. How can you not be fired up? Ash Mafara just handed all of us a silver platter. He did it a long time ago, but now the silver platter is getting more full of stuff that we had no idea was coming our way. So you're all walking around with this silver platter. Boom, you had some things put on it two months ago, a month ago. It's getting heavy, isn't it? That silver platter that Ash Mafara handed us is getting heavy. Well, I've got news for you. It's going to get heavier. i got better news for you. You're not going to have to carry it. Ash Mafara, the tech team. Woo! They're going to carry it for you. Think about it. There's a new one. I love coming up with new ones. Ash Mafara held, handed us all a silver platter. And each month he keeps throwing some more stuff on that silver platter. Oh, oh, it's getting heavy. I need a wheelbarrow. It's so heavy. And then I think Ash Mafara's got this. Ash Mafara's going to carry that silver platter for us. The tech team in Hyderabad are going to carry that silver platter for, silver platter for us. Do you get it? Can you dig it, folks? Can you dig it? I got to love that. That's pretty funny. All right. Who am I saying? Who am I missing? I don't know. Casey Zevenberg, what's happening? Uh, there's M. Kelly. Way you're all at the bottom. I got to get you back on top, M. Kelly. Uh, Angie Han, yay. She got off the executive call and came on to see me. Isn't that nice? Well, well, I love my sister from Germany. Angie Han is a humongous supporter. Uh, she's been on all these webinars in Bangladesh, India where I've been doing other things. Angie definitely is carrying that platter over there, Angie. Way to go. Keep doing what you're doing. Uh, Kushal, I think I got everyone. Listen to me. I got to get going because, my gosh, I don't want to be responsible for Marty De Garmo ever to be late. He'll be coming on in uh, supposedly six minutes and probably nine minutes. He might even be out here watching me. But everyone knows, look it. Now, Marty was picking on me. He said, oh, with your three people, your three people. I got 91 people today. I'm proud. And if it was three people, Marty, I'd still be proud. The greatest thing is, Ash Mafara, what did he say? You pick on my founders, I'm going to get you. And that's what Ash did. He just doesn't do it for me. He protects all of you. You guys don't understand that yet. Look it. Guess who's calling me? Let's, this ought to be fun. Marty DeGarmo, you are on live because I got minutes, man. What you got? <laughs> hey, can I tell you something? You know I'm your friend, right? I'm your brother, right? Yeah. Remember now, you're on live and Ash is listening. Okay. <laughs> uh, 
that's okay. I just want to let you know, I love you very much. You can save a lot of time if you record this live. Since there's only three people, you can do it every other day and have six people. Hey, it's a good idea, but I got a lot of people today. And I barely advertise. These these are these are what I call my hardcore Chris Johnson. They want to be fired up. Ash said, leave me alone, Marty. <laughs> Are you coming on time today? Well, <laughs> I gotta go on now that I'm almost late already. No, it's, I got four minutes. You got four minutes. I'm gonna end this here in a couple seconds. I think we gave people a laugh. And uh you guys heard it from Marty. That's what we do. We are gonna be starting in the future a podcast. And it's gonna be called what, Marty? What's the great name I gave it? Yes, we are. Two, two peas. Two peas in a pod. Two peas in a pod. All right, we'll be doing that. <laughs> it's gonna be fun. I guarantee it's gonna be funny. We're gonna have special guests on. We haven't even really decided what we're how we're gonna do it, but it's gonna be Bill. Bill Must says he's my number one fan. <laughs> but it'll be a lot of fun. Uh we, we talked about this a long time ago. Once we get everything going here, we're going to. That's, that's great. The, the invisible man is your number one fan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, he's the most powerful invisible man I know. <laughs> All right. Did he hang up? He hung up. All right. There you have it. Once again, Marty DeGarbo, he'll be coming out here in a couple minutes. Go check him out. He's always got some really good things to say. And yeah, he gets a lot more people than me, but because he deserves it. But that's okay. I, I appreciate it just for anyone that listens. My job, like I said, is to fire you up. Red, Red and Marty's job, as far as I'm concerned, is to give you the updates, explain things. I'm not an explainer. I'm a doer, baby. I'm the, I'm the guy that's got to come up to you and give you tickle, tickle. We want you smiling and laughing because I shouldn't even have to do that. Ash gave us the silver platter. Don't you ever forget that. All right. If I missed you, I'll get you in the comments. I love you. You guys check in your back office daily for the things that are happening. Go to the update section. Check out Peter Shore's notes uh, along with uh, Daryl Cook and Janet Butler. You guys did an excellent job. I know that was not easy. We do appreciate you guys with those notes. I love the notes. I really do love the notes. Red's recaps, Marty's recaps, everything. Ash coming on 360 to help us out, guys. If you are confused, there's many, this is, and this is the easiest classroom you've ever been. All the answers are there. You can go to 360. You can rewatch Ash Mafar in the back office. What do you have to say? You can watch Red Redford's updates. You can read Peter's notes along with uh, Daryl Cook and Janet Butler, who was there. Read their notes, learn, educate. It's here. It's here, folks. Understand this. It's here. If you don't understand something, we've got a million different ways to explain it to you. Don't you forget that. All right. I got to go. I left Marty with almost two minutes here. Check out Marty in less than two minutes. Red Redford's coming on at one o'clock. Uh, I think it's one o'clock. Yes. One o'clock. Red's coming on probably because he's doing his both. We are all messed up at our times, but that's okay. We are going to be doing whatever we got to do to keep you guys informed. Don't you forget that. Kathy Sampson, how you doing? Uh, Patricia Parent, there you are. Lynn Nakamoto, what's happening? Lynn, you got something going on today with uh, the O-Tech pros at 2 o'clock, I think. I'm not sure. I haven't seen the back office. Please put it in here. Uh, who else is on here? Everyone. Everyone, everyone. Let's do this. Be excited. Fire up. Go! On passive, number one. On passive, number one. Everyone else is below, but on passive, it's going to be up there, number one. And you're all part of it. All right, I got to go. I love everyone here. Happy birthday, John. Happy birthday, Ravi. May you be blessed with many more. And guess what? Next year, boy, if you got a birthday in the next couple of days, happy birthday. Wait till you see the celebration next year. <laughs> I love everyone here. I got to go. Marty DeGarmo, the floor is yours. Hey, my three guys, go, so go see Marty, will you? All right, bye.